Ever notice your phone getting hot while charging? Or after extended use? EVs are the same. When their batteries fast charge or accelerate quickly, they also heat up. This can cause problems. Prolonged heating can shorten the battery's lifespan or even cause a fire. Hi, I'm Dr. C. Today we're talking about why batteries heat up and what we can do about it. First, picture a tungsten light bulb. When the current flows through the resistant filament, it heats up and produces light. Using this equation, we explain how heat is generated. Take a look. You'll see that aside from current, resistance is a key factor in generating heat in batteries. Today's battery packs generally have high output power, often reaching 300 to 400 kilowatt. To sustain such high performance, we think that reducing resistance is particularly important. At CATL, we've addressed resistance through improvements in structure, materials, and processes. First, we have shortened the current path, we have increased the cross-sectional area of conductive components, and we have optimized welding. Together, these steps have reduced cell resistance by 7% compared to traditional cells. We've also adjusted our electrolyte formula by increasing the proportion of low viscosity solvents. This has improved conductivity. The result, resistance has decreased by an additional 10% compared to 2C electrolytes. We optimize our cathode coating technology. Cathode coating is like the shell around a pill. It's a special coating around the cathode material that reduces direct contact with the electrolyte. This protective layer also speeds up ion migration and creates a super electronic conductive network. Ultimately, this enables faster electron transfer. As a result of this innovation, internal resistance dropped from 0.05 milliohm to 0.3 milliohm. This both reduces heat during supercharging and increases charging efficiency. Sounds great, right? But just reducing internal heat isn't enough. That's why we've also improved our battery pack cooling system. CATL's Chilin battery features large flexible water cooling plates. These slow temperatures raise and dissipate heat faster. We've also built a precise thermal management system to ensure that the battery pack stays reliable and safe. By addressing both internal and external heat, We've got battery heating under control. Don't worry, we've got you covered. Well, that's all for today. Thank you for joining our CATL Tech Explainer. Stay curious and keep powering forward.